The Sydney Harbour Bridge has a new helper, a climbing robot designed to inspect hidden passengers inside the arches. Engineers at the University of Technology Sydney have teamed up with Roads and Maritime Services to develop the machine which navigates around the pitch black tunnels, checking the condition of the bridge. The Harbour Bridge has her secrets, a vast network of hidden passageways. It's the first time this section has been opened in five years. The paintwork dates back to 1932. This robot's designed to get into small spaces and climb around the arches, checking for defects. It's safer, definitely. It's better to send a machine in a confined space than myself because if something happened to me, uh, I would be blocked inside. High above the road, there are internal tunnels with steep drop-offs. There's no room for a stretcher and small openings every six metres would make a rescue difficult, if not impossible. There's risk of uh, asphyxiation, uh, air quality is an issue inside the arch. These days we prefer to send robots in to do the dangerous jobs. The robot navigates using a 3D sensor, creating a map of the space and giving engineers crucial detail about what needs fixing. There are more than seven kilometres of these narrow passageways along the arches of the bridge and the next stage of this project will see a robot clean and paint the area at the same time. The next robot will use lasers to vaporise rust, have a vacuum to remove it and a machine attached to paint safely without the need for workers to delve inside. We can see this on other structures uh, like uh, transmission towers and ship hulls, uh, nuclear reactors. So other places where you don't want to send people, uh, it's too difficult to access. The robots won an International Technology Award in Sri Lanka and a Work Safety Prize back home. It's hoped the next version, complete with lasers, will be ready in three years' time. Nicole Chettle, ABC News, Sydney.